Hi, I'm Derek Oxton with In Flight Archery. One of the biggest challenges you're going to face as an aerial archer is trying to find someone that's willing to throw as many targets as you're going to need to get good. Now, I've had family and I've had friends throw for me for a lot of years and I've got some other mechanized means of throwing targets, but I've never had anything to throw small targets, so I was thinking a little while back that I ought to build something. Um, I'm, not a, I'm not a mechanical engineer, I'm not claiming to have built a great, a great thrower, but it works. Um, and I'm going to give you a link to the, so the link right here, if you want to go back and you can read on our website about the blog how I built this, it goes step by step, tells you the components I used. One of the big flaws was the trigger in that initial one that you, you know, the, the one that you just read about, or I just linked to. Um, so I did a version 2.0, which you can follow this link, link right here to go back to our website and see the improvements that I made on that. But overall, um, this catapult is a wonderful tool to be able to shoot by yourself. Now you'll see that it's armed with a, a little bit of twine, so I can go back as far as I want, and I can pull that remotely without the help of anyone else. Now this is fantastic because it's hard to find someone to shoot as much as I want, or to throw as much as I want to practice. So if you've got any ideas on how to improve this, or maybe throwers that you've made by yourself, feel free to leave comments um, in the, the comments below on YouTube here, or get a hold of me on, on the website, www.inflightarchery.com. So the way this works, basic catapult goes down, clicks, keep your head clear as you lean over to, to put a wiffle ball on it. That was one of the lessons my son learned. Not the ones going to be shooting with me, the younger one. So once it's armed, it's ready to go. So I could set any kind of target on this that I want. And then it's as simple as pulling the little string and target goes flying. So I'm going to grab my, my five-year-old son and uh, we're going to shoot a little bit on this. Don't know that we're going to have any hits. And also the lighting's not great because we're kind of shooting into the sun a little bit. Um, but at least you'll be able to see it in action. And of course you hit it when uh, you forget to push the record button. Let me grab this real quick. Of course, we didn't hit record. So we'll leave it on and we'll try it. See if the second shot can be as lucky. All right, then you ready? Three, two, one, pull. Nope. Two out of three is not bad. So as you can see, the little catapult thrower is a lot of fun for tiny targets. If you've got any improvements on what I've done here, I'd love to see it. Leave some comments or get a hold of me through the website, and I'll talk to you later. Thanks. This is Derek with Inflight Archery. Keep shooting.